Yeah, I mean, this practice can be very healing. Um, when we bring this caring awareness, this gentle awareness to the body um, and offer the body space and attention, we allow the sensations um, allowance, you know, non-judgment. We, we open to the sensations to be here. We, we allow them to be here. And oftentimes that's new. <laughs> like usually if we're thinking, if we're planning, if we're doing things, usually we're not bringing like full awareness to the sensations usually for most of us um and in some way we're not really fully allowing the station the not fully allowing the sensations to fully be expressed to fully be felt or allowing them to change or to intensify or, or to go. Sometimes we hold on to sensations subconsciously. But when we bring this mindfulness to the body, oftentimes we notice sensations we've either never noticed before or we notice significant discomfort. Um, <clears throat> I've heard different explanations for this. The main one is that as we develop our mindfulness and as we develop our insula in, in our brain, which is responsible for interoception as we allow as we build or strengthen the insula which is responsible for us being able to sense into the body more and more when we strengthen the insula we notice more and more kinds of sensations in the body And they're not always pleasant. And so you know, so we're strengthening the insula, and but we're also strengthening our courage to to open to experience that's not pleasant, that's not content, that's not maybe quote unquote safe. We build our courage to open up to experience that's unpleasant. Maybe we're afraid to sense into certain sensations, certain emotions in the body, as emotions live in the body. Um, so we're, we're building our insula that allows us to sense into sensations more and more. We're building our courage to open to more types of unpleasant experience without judging it, without pushing it away, without trying to change it, we're more fully opening and allowing these kinds of sensations to surface in our awareness. So usually these sensations are always there or they're waiting for allowance. They're waiting for welcoming. They're waiting for 
um, this sort of friendly welcome. Because these sensations are not bad or wrong. They're just there. And there are reasons why they're here. And that's okay. And, um, and so mindfulness allows us to open to them, allow them to be. And if we can stay with them with this gentle, caring awareness without trying to change them, usually the discomfort will change. And we will find more ease the sensations sometimes just heal because especially if they're emotional in nature. Um, but sometimes just physical trauma will ease as well. And um, the pain of it, like, I mean, a lot of science shows that pain will decrease over time too with mindfulness, usually. We provide you with the certification and the credentials you need to teach mindfulness in professional settings. I invite you to check out our uh, webpage at teach.mindfulnessexercises.com to learn more about the program and uh, I look forward to seeing you on the inside.